everybody. Long time no see. Um, you can see how big Little Dutch is getting and notice of the leg. Uh, we had a really, really bad situation occur. Um, oh, she's laying on my jacket. Where uh, last Monday, a week ago today, well, on Sunday, I've been going to the homeless shelter because they changed it to Sundays instead of Wednesdays. And when I got home, my husband came outside and said, we have a problem, the puppy's not walking. And I said, no, you gotta be kidding me, right? So I go in, I go to touch it, and she was guarding it pretty fiercely, um, not fighting me, but letting me know that um, she was hurt. So, um, sit, honey, sit, 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 baby girl, sit. So, uh, by the next morning, you can see she had IVs. By the next morning, um, oh, I'm sorry, she hit it. By the next morning, she had, this is quite a combo, huh? The plaid with the hounds tooth. I just wore this to go outside really quick. Um, she had, uh, God, I'm sorry, there's so much. Uh, she was listless. She looked just like yes. Iron Maiden. She was laying, uh, her tongue was partially coming out of her mouth. I tried deli, she wouldn't eat it. She had no life in her at all. She wasn't guarding the leg at all anymore. This leg was probably this thick. So I ran my daughter to school. I, I came back like a bat out of hell. I grabbed her and um, threw her in the car and back to that emergency hospital where I brought meat in that dreadful night, which, you know, my anxiety and post-traumatic stress was like going through the moon because I had just been there. And they're saying, I'm like, I don't know her leg and she's just listless and I don't know. I don't know if I'm overreacting because of what just happened with Maiden. I, I don't really know. And um, so I sat outside because I can't go in. So I gave, you can see there's stitches here. Um, and her ankles all just formed. But her leg was up to here. So they think, anyways, they called the car and they said she has 106 fever. You're not overreacting. She's being admitted to critical care. So um, I thought she may have been injured up here. So they shaved the leg, they didn't see any injuries. They took x-rays, there was um, no, uh, no broken anything, um, but she had an abscess. And what they did find was like a little foreign body that looked like a tooth that maybe one of her siblings, um, when she was a puppy, left and her body had been trying to fight it all along. And, um, it just blew and her body couldn't fight it anymore. So she blew a major infection. So little that she was in ICU for four days um, on injectable pain medication, IVs. She had an operation where they went in and drained and explored and flushed out the limb. Um, she's on two antibiotics, a anti-inflammatory, and a um, gabapentin, like Mina was on to, to sedate her, keep her kind of chill. She's uh, she's teething too, amongst all of this other stuff she has to deal with, this poor little baby. So in one week she had, this time last week we were, I was outside the hospital just crying, um, going, what am I gonna do? This all came to the grand total of $4,900. I started at fifteen hundred. I left. I gave him fifteen hundred that day, and by day three we were up to about thirty-five, and then by day four we were up to forty-nine. And they released her uh, Thursday, so to hope to get her home for the weekend, so she'd start feeling better. Which she's feeling so much better. She wasn't walking at all before, but now she's walking. So yeah, uh, welcome to my world. <laughs> I hope everybody's doing good. It just seems like a nightmare. I mean, what I just went through with poor Iron Maiden and she's only 16 weeks old and to have to, okay, gotta let go. I don't have, you really need your, ouch, ouchie. Um, she's beautiful though and she's, uh, she's doing, uh, doing good. But I think I'm gonna change her name to either Thumper or my little BMW because I was looking at a car and, uh, 
for what I spent between her and Maiden in the, since uh, June, over $10,000. Um, <laughs> that's some rotty love, huh? That is some rotty love. She doesn't know she could care less, right? What type of car I drive. But um, anyways, I just thought I'd check in. And I've been getting these cool food subscription boxes um, that I wanted to do some videos on and show you guys. And I hope everybody's doing well. But yeah, I know a lot of people were watching Duchess as a baby. And um, I mean, she's still a baby. Everything is fine. All her blood work. And they did ultrasound. And her organs, they said her immune system up apparently probably couldn't handle they believe it a derived out of here the ankle which to me they seem right i mean i said the knee because it was so swelled so it was moving up so they said that no i wasn't overreacting like my other vet used to say i was overreacting with maiden and the maiden died right i said no i wasn't overreacting i saved her life given a couple more hours or even another day when it went into like the infection was popping all the way up when it went into like her abdominal cavity but hopefully her hair comes back it looks like it's grown back already uh, she has a comb she has to sleep with that at night so yeah it's been good times good times all right love you guys hope you're all doing good have you guys ever dealt with an abscess and uh on your dog or Anything like that? Uh, oh, she's gonna talk for you. You gonna say hi? You wanna say hi? She's feeling so much better. That's not very ladylike, is it? No. no. We don't care as long as you're happy again. I'm gonna show them your teeth. Your teeth in the front are like mostly gone. But she's definitely feeling better. All right, bye.